Can you please again share uh, your name and where are you from? Uh, my name is Carly and I'm from Richland. Carly, can you please um, tell us what were the things you were struggling with? So um, I have two kids, they're very close in age. <laughs> and um, with my first son, I started having really bad back pain toward the end of my pregnancy. I figured it was just being pregnant and that it would go away. Um, it didn't. When I got pregnant with my second, uh, my daughter, it got way worse. And ever since then, I've struggled with really bad back pain. So, yeah. And can you please tell us how, how did that pain affect your daily life? Oh, it was horrible. There was times that like, I would wake up and just be like, I am not doing anything today because I am hurting so bad. Um, I did have to go to the doctor a few times and it never really came of much. Um, but yeah, it, through, for my day-to-day -day life, it was very, very difficult for me to get anything done and especially with two little ones, like nothing. And so for how long altogether you had that pain? Um, probably a year and a half is about. And what happened uh, two weeks ago? So two weeks ago, Pastor Vlad, um, along with the nightmares, he was also praying. After that, he prayed um, for lower back pain, which is exactly where I was experiencing my back pain. So I was like, okay, maybe, you know, I had been praying for it. I was like, God, please heal me. But with everybody praying and Pastor Vlad praying, I was like, maybe this is my night. So I put my hand on my lower back and I was just praying and everybody was. And um, all of a sudden, like as we were praying, I got like chills and my back was actually hurting that very minute too. And he was like, if your back is hurting you right now, put your hand there. And it was, it was actually hurting really bad. I was about ready. I was up here, but I was about ready to go sit down and like be done like for then. Um, so I got chills and then at that moment, it was like, it was like the Holy Spirit was in me, like healing, like literally physically heal healing me. And then it literally just went away and I haven't had anything since. Wow. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So the pain left you right after the prayer? During. During, during the, yeah. And so right now it's been two weeks. How do you feel? Fabulous. I'm like, I'm like wanting to do everything now because I'm like, oh my gosh, I feel so good. But yeah. What can you do now that you could not do before? Um, it was affecting me to the point where like my daily routine, like it'd be so hard to just go get groceries. Like something so simple that seems so simple, it was like a very big challenge for me because, you know, carrying the kids to the car, actually getting out and doing it. Now I'm like... I. It's like I feel normal, I guess. Like I can just do it, do my chores, like all of that. So. And no pain whatsoever? Nope. No. Hallelujah. Let's put our hands together for Jesus Christ. We thank God for your amazing healing and what the Holy Spirit did for you. Carly, can you please share a word of advice for people who might be uh, feeling pain in the body right now at the moment? What can you tell them? Pray. I mean... You might be praying so much and you're thinking, oh my gosh, God is not helping me, but just keep going, like keep praying. God can heal anything. And if you pray enough, he will deliver. So. Hallelujah. Thank you so much. Thank you, Kylie, for sharing this amazing testimony.